Hello pig farmers and pig lovers. Welcome back to Edovasa Pig Farm. My name is Daniel Ezeji, founder of Edovasa Pig Farm Enugu. So for a while now we have been we have been on this Azola and Duckweed farming trend. So this is the establishment of our new pond where we used this uh, cheap uh, nylon and hopefully if we don't have uh, anyone tampering with it especially our pigs running out of the farm sometimes i think it can stay for some time so we've done the water treatment last video we showed you how we when we fill the water after it passed the water leaking test we have treated the water added the nutrients in the water and now we have planted our azola and duckweed so if you take a close look you will see this is azola why these ones that have a Buddha uh, shell, shell like uh, leaves, they are the duckweed. So we try to combine the two so that we can harness the good stuff each of them have. Since uh, from our own experiment, we found out that they grow together and they do very well together. So even in their natural habitat, they tend to also grow together there. Now, the beauty of this is how sustainable the farming is. The Azola and duckweed farming to help you substitute for proteins like uh, soya bean, granite cake, uh, even fish meal, blood meal, and the rest. It's a sustainable way of farming protein in the sense that you can see just this little stuff on this sponge. By the time we come back seven days after, you will see that this whole place will be filled up because they will keep reproducing, keep, divide, uh, keep dividing themselves and keep multiplying and uh, until they fill up this whole pond. You understand? So what we put here was just a handful. And over here, the same thing. Over here, the same thing. Just a handful. But uh, seven days from now, you will discover that this whole place will be filled up to the brim, just like here. Uh, this was where we have harvested this morning to feed our pigs. We mix. We are currently mixing it in our uh, winner's diet, fresh. You understand? So this was where we harvested from. Also, when we planted here, it was just scanty again, but now it's filled up. But because we harvested some to replant and also to feed, so we have some of this space. But in the next one or two days, you see this place will also be filled up. But we plan to be harvesting daily. And as our pond keep multiplying, we'll be increasing our daily harvest, you know, to the point that we'll get to what we are looking to achieve. So Azola and duckweed farming is a sustainable way of growing uh, protein-dense uh, leaves in a hydroponic system for your livestock. Not only pig, even your fish, your snails, your chicken, the broiler, the cockerel, anyone, you can just grow this, mix it with a little quantity of their food or in a one, one is to one ratio and you'll be getting good results. So at Edovasa Pig Farm, we have adopted this technology, this innovation, and uh, so far so good. It has been helping us. We're even expanding with our 15 or 20 ponds in our new site so that we can be harvesting this, drying it, and incorporating it into our Edovasa pig concentrate so that we can make our concentrates more dense with protein and amino acids so that pigs, your pigs will keep enjoying it more and more. So uh, remember, to set it up is very, it doesn't cost so much. It doesn't cost so much. You can see the materials we use here. These are materials you can get for very low prices in the market. Over there, we used tampolin, but we have tested this one and it's work, It's holding water pretty well. So let's see how far this one goes. All right, so till next time we come your way, remember, you can reach us via the phone number attached to the description in this video and let us know what you will need. So I will encourage you to be like a Dovasa Pig Farm find ways to reduce your feed costs so that you can always smile back from the market anytime any day because you are you are you, are, you, you have kissed uh, high cost production 
bye bye just like we have done here at edovasa pig farm using spent grain azola and edovasa pig concentrates so till next time we come your way keep farming rights and stay blessed